A state-of-the-art facility for research and development for Whirlpool, the new technology center will replace most of the current building and is the first of a three-phase plan to redesign the decades-old St. Joseph Technology Center. Work in this facility will focus on consumer solutions like testing dryers or dishwashers in its 21 testing labs and will still employ more than 500 technicians, engineers and designers. The ribbon cutting for this new facility joined by local leaders who say they're grateful to have such a loyal company in southwest Michigan. So uh, I'm just very pleased that Whirlpool as a corporation uh, has uh, really sunk its roots here, obviously, but has maintained those roots. Whirlpool has invested more than $230 million in new or expanded facilities in St. Joseph and Benton Harbor in the last 10 years. The company says there are always other offers and places the company could move, but chooses to stay here. Whirlpool CEO says some factories have second or even third generation employees, that the community has been loyal in return. And with 3,500 employees from different departments in the area, there are a lot of reasons to stay. Once we attract people here, um, the best town throughout the world, into being in Southwest Michigan, we get a good sense of loyalty. Um, so we get good productivity out there, good engineering, and we get good skills here. Governor Gretchen Whitmer says the investment is a good sign for not just St. Joe in Mitten Harbor, but all of Michigan. This local community, without question, feels it every single day, from the barber shop to the grocery store to the schools. Whirlpool employees and their families have a massive impact on the economy here. I'm John Paul. Thanks for watching. Here's another video for you to watch. Also, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel.